Oh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Outer Worlds. Uh, yesterday, we got all the research, and today we got to go back to the Groundbreaker and turn the research into Gladys. However, now that I'm back on the ship, there is one thing I did want to do. Because we got the acid steeper, so I want to make this guy work. Hey Sam, what's up? Let's get you going. Install the SSD. Initiating initialization sequences. Greetings, nice. customer! This SAM unit is unable to locate your registered information. Would you like to register your SAM? Why yes Registering I would. Registering new owner. Captain! <laughs> Welcome to the crew, Sam. Sam. It's live to clean and clean to live. All right. Well, we have Sam. I wonder if he's going to go around cleaning the ship. <laughs> he probably will. Uh, these are the crew quarters for some of the crew. I believe this is Parvati's. And along the way, we pick up stuff. And it adds them to the crew quarters, which is kind of, kind of cool. Oh, Felix's journal. Must be Felix's room, obviously. This was Picker Max's room. This must be Ellie's. Shoot, I forgot. It'll come to me. <laughs> yep, I already cleaned the ship. Good job. Hey guys, what's happening? You guys wear your helmets even on the ship? Wow, okay. Go back down to Ada. And go to the groundbreaker. The groundbreaker has approved our request for docking, Captain. You're free to disembark. Why thank you, Ada. So I leveled up. Let's do that first. Um, I want to add some more into here. There, now that's at 40. And get this up to 40. Well, I got five more points to spend here. Um... Go some more in a dialogue. Because that'll be at 50 soon. Then I can specialize in something. Put another point in tech. Another point in ranged. There. All done. Okay. Now. Going out. Uh, we're going to leave Ellie home. We're going to take Parvati and Vector Max. Just because Vector Max, we have, uh, didn't we have something with Vector Max? Honestly, I don't remember. Oh no, we did do his thing. Okay. Where we had to sneak in and, uh, Tap in the terminal. That's alright. We'll keep him with us anyway. I don't think there's a whole lot to do here. 
other than turn in a couple of missions. Gotta get the nav key from uh, Gladys. Alright guys, you ready? Let's go. Hey, be careful with those crates, huh? My yeah, be careful with those. What's up, buddy? Okay, we had to go turn in because we never did turn in the body. the hunt. I've been ruminating on it, Very good. and I decided if you ain't killed McRed yet, I want you to hurt him a little before you do. Nothing excessive, mind you, but the scoundrel deserves a light beating at least before he kicks off. Okay, well, good news. I killed Captain McRed, and I roughed him up a little. Yes, I did. I believe I'm growing fond of you, bounty hunter. If you got the Mardettes backs, the Mardettes have got yours. Here's the bounty payout. Nice work down there. With any luck, we can hire more sharp-eyed bounty hunters like you in the future. Nice. Okay. Uh, getting some bit cartridges, some Ali Ali Toxy Free, lots of experience. My reputation has increased for the groundbreaker. Uh, whatever bounty, what other, what bounties do you With have? With that bastard available? McRed dead, there ain't much else in the offing. Not that I'm complaining, mind you. Okay. See you later. All right. Now we had to go back to Gladys. I'm gonna check out our uh, reputations first. Uh, we're friendly with the Groundbreaker. Haven't met these guys yet. Oh, well, we did meet Sublet Salvage. We haven't done anything for them, so. Oh, we're positive with the board a little bit. Really positive with the Groundbreaker. We're friendly with them. Uh, Anti Cleo, we are neutral. Revering with Spacer's Choice and Deserters. So they really like us. So, that's a good thing. This one's Purple Berry Punch. You want a punch? We've got your punch right here. Okay. Hey, Martin. How's it going? I always got to stop in and see Martin. Is it just me or is I can Red sell something to him. feeling extra chilly? Maybe you ought to help yourself to a piping hot frozen dinner. Maybe. Uh, let's see. Uh, have a look. Let's trade. Sell all my junk. Because I get a discount with these guys because they really like me. So, let's see. What do we have? We ain't got nothing that I want for this. Or this. I, I do need a hack, right? I don't know. I think I have one of these. I think I just gave it to Vicar Max. Definitely don't need any of this. <laughs> I had the defective one. What's this? Nope. Uh, what do you got for any of this stuff? See, I have that nicotine, uh, withdrawal negative perk. So, I gotta make sure I'm stocked up on cigarettes. <laughs> oh no, it's just like real life. Yeah, I just quit smoking, so, uh, but man, I can relate being addicted to it, let me tell you. It's a rough road. Alright, we're not going to steal any of those. Let's go in here. Hi, buddy. This is hey, I wonder. I remembered something. Um. See what my... 
sneak skill is. I can pickpocket now. And I wanted to get into those. So I wonder. However, before I do, just in case I get caught, let's try a little tactic here of sh save it so that way I can. Okay. Deceptions and lies. Don't believe the board. Monarch has shed the yoke of its corporate overlords and now thrives. Oh crap! Wrong button. <laughs> but philosophism lives on. Oh. We fight from the shadow of your. Okay. Let's try that again. Okay. I don't know if I dare take more than that. Our yeah, but I did anyway. Okay. Thanks, buddy. This come on, guys. Come in here. Come in here. You come in here. No come on. All the way in. Parati. No come on. <laughs> come on now. Good job. Alright, let's try. Now we can get into these. Look at this. Heck yeah! Oh man, I'm loving it. Oh no, it only gives me... Oh no! For real? I had the card. Did it only give me one use? No way. Oh, that's so gay. Dang it. Okay. Hey, buddy. You wouldn't happen to have another one of them, would you? <laughs> Let's find out. That'd be funny if he did. Nothing. Dang it, man. Ah. Guess it was like an eeny, meeny, miny, moe thing. You kind of had to, uh... Pick and choose what you were gonna do here. Stop, stranger, dude. All right, here's Gladys. Oh man, look at that! I can't pick that. You guys are in here. Damn it! Have you had right, a moment up, to look into that little opportunity I told you about on Roseway? You don't hurry up. Yes, I have. Someone will get to snooping around there before you do. Oh, don't worry. I took care of it. Uh, I investigated the distress signal from Roseway. What's that? Speak up now. Uh, uh, about those secrets you asked me to look for. What'd you for. turn up? Um, I found the fancy toothpaste formula. <laughs> Here you go. Uh, lie in science. I found a formula for experimental rocket fuel. Seems like pretty advanced stuff. Oh. Okay, well, yeah. My stars, what a find. Fine picking like this deserves an equally fine payout. Go on, dear. Thank you. And don't spend it all in one place. Yes, ma'am. Nice. I don't know. Maybe I should have got like all three, but you know. Uh, we've lost anti cleo's research data. Okay. That's fine. Um, I acquired some research on Rapidon Musk. Interested? Pardon me, sweetheart. My old ears must have misheard you. Did you say wrapped it on? Gracious. Yes. Someone must have hauled them off Monarch. Naughty, naughty. A couple of folks around here might pay a fair few bits for this. Might even be able to start a bidding war. Okay. Nice. Nice payout. Um... I found a prototype weapon schematic from Force, <laughs> but I lost it. Bless your slippery little fingers. Isn't that just a shame? Prototype schematics go for a fair handful of bits around here. Oh. See, I knew I should have. <laughs> I knew I should have taken it. Oh, I think that was it. I can't do these right now. My skill's not positive? high enough. Honest to goodness. Well, yes, ma'am. I'm certain there's nothing can't left. Can't say I wasn't hoping for more, but I suppose it can't be helped. 
Law bless you for doing but the legwork, do. sweetie. Don't forget your pal Gladys. I do have now. enough to buy this. You can come visit any time. Thank you. Let's buy this first, because we do need it. Fantastic. Do be careful with it, dear, as these keys tend to be a tad hard to acquire. You should okay. have a chat with Lily Hagen in the sublight offices. She's a dear. You'll love her. Now, was there anything else? Uh... Wanna yeah, turn the off quick. that girl who runs the pub? She's a fierce arm wrestler. But she's no match for your pal Gladys. Oh, so you're a good arm wrestler, huh? Okay. Let's see what you got there, Gladys. Officer Spine. Which... My one companion already has that. Oh, no armor. Um, pet pills. Don't really need any of this. Got most of these. I get a pretty good discount from uh, these guys here too on the groundbreaker. I'm gonna be able to set foot on a whole of. Go back to my character because, see, I think these were all good when I started. Um, however, because of that uh, negative on my uh, Planet. I know what do you call it? That because uh, I'm addicted to cigarettes. That kind of gives me negatives. I mean, not too bad. I mean, I'm still average, but uh, still. But I'm not is a wretched uh, of finding any. in here. Hey, hey, buddy. <laughs> Thanks, friend. Okay, I'm liking this pickpocketing thing. Alright, before we leave, let's go check out some of the other vendors here. That's a medical bay. CNP near maple syrup. It's near this complete breakfast. Okay, yep, yep. You're the one I wanted to check Ooh, out real quick. You're here. It'll do a lot for my Ooh. credit in the promenade if people see you buying something. So... What'll it be? Okay, well, because of my reputation must be, so... Uh, let's see what we got here. Inferno site. Now that's... See, that's kind of cool. Back helmet? Uh, back helmet. Medical. That's not too bad. Uh, mining helmet hack plus five. That'll help in case I ever need hacking. Sneak. Nope, don't need that. Don't need that. Ordnance Control Armor Gold? Uh. Pristine and gold. See, I don't know. I don't really know the whole ins and outs of uh, 
what armors feel good and what's not. Just for the heck of it, why not? Let's see what you got. You got nothing for that. All right, what can I sell to you that I don't need? I mean, I think I kept all these for a reason. I think. That one doesn't do anything, though, so... Let's sell that. Mm, yeah, I don't need that. Oh, persuade. Another sneak. Lockpick. And another persuade. I don't think I need two of these, do I? I don't think I do. Okay, next. Uh, nothing else I really want to sell at the moment. I don't know. I mean, did I need this for something? <laughs> I really don't know. Uh, let's see if it's in my quest items here. Nope, that's just in my general, because here's my quest. There's the nav key. Okay, hey, so we're going to sell him that music box. What are they... Here, buddy. Take a music box. Groundbreaker's safe from melting to bits now. Lots of good people yep. can rest easy because of you. Uh, what was that about back at June Lee's? Well, I didn't expect her to be so tall. And did you see the size of her <laughs> arms? Uh huh. <laughs> Sounds like you have a crush on what? her. What? No. Maybe? I don't. It's like somebody reached into my head and pulled out what I didn't know I wanted. You know how hard it is to find anybody who likes working with tools in a little town like Edgewater? <laughs> hmm, sounds like you're not sure how you feel. This won't interfere with your work, will it? Uh, there's more to a relationship than BP arms and a shared career. And there's worse places to start. Did you see how everybody True. on Groundbreaker listens to June Lay? She's just, here's how to fix it, and they trust her. It's just, she's calm and knows what to do. I wish I was half so confident. Okay, well, cool. Uh, what do you think of the new guy, Felix? He seems like a nice boy to me. I'm glad you gave him a shot. <laughs> he didn't seem very bright. Well, he doesn't talk all smarty smart, but he can still have a good where it counts. In his heart, I mean. I mean, sure, he's a bit rough around the edges. I bet he just needs somebody to show him a better path. Oh, you seriously think I'm the right sort to put him on the right course in life? You might surprise yourself. Yeah, I just might. Okay. All right, any Cleo... All organic Do you have anything I want? materials are served at an excessive temperature. May this unit dispense proteins for your ingestion. Uh-huh. <laughs> Aren't you a glorified video Beginning machine? dispensing sequence. Please unblock all relevant facial protein ingestion tubes. Yeah, okay. Ah. White patch. I'm gonna take all those. That'll help with my, uh, Nicotine withdrawal thing. Have you seen this man? For more? Oh, oh, I've got another slot available. Nice. Okay, where was that pipe patch thing? 
Put that on, pipe patch. All right, let's see. And put those on. Okay, so now we have these two. Uh, pack of stogies. Nicotine high. Range weapon spread minus 50. Range weapon sway minus 50. So it helps steady out my weapons. That'll be a good thing. This does the same thing. I wonder if they stack. Oh. Let's find out. I could very well be wrong. Oh, see, now everything's back to good. Awesome. Okay, so yeah, that's definitely an addiction. Alright, there was one more vendor I wanted to check out before we leave. Hey, how you doing? It get cooler in here? I swear they had the heat turned way the hell up. <laughs> oh, what do you got? Doesn't look like anything I really want. Nope, you don't have squat. Okay. All right, come on, guys, we're out of here. We're out of here. Inform Dr. Wells you have the nav key. You see we had a conveyor pull in? Back on board our ship. I believe I hear Felix and Parvati discussing the latest Aetherwave serial. Okay, well, that's good that they're talking about a TV show. I'm glad they're getting along. <laughs> that's a good thing. Let's go check on the crew, see how they're doing. So I was watching this serial the other night, yeah? Halcyon Helen finally took down the Chief of the Savages with a guest appearance from none other than the Masked Marketeer! Oh gosh, I wish you'd waited for me. I wanted to see that too. Oh, you, you guys don't have to stop talking just because I'm here? No, no, really, it's okay. I mean, uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Fine, whatever. I'm going to get my ship clean. Dust accumulation analysis. 2.5 years. Good Thank work, you. Sam. Customer, Sam. We guarantee you it's the only sanitation and maintenance unit you'll ever need. <laughs> Back to work, buddy. Uh, he's kind of cool. I think we're going to take him along. At some point, see exactly how he does here. Okay, so we have the nav key. I don't know, do I want to do that one right now? Actually, return to the unreliable and ask for body. You know, what? let's do that real quick. I was actually thinking about another one, but. Since it gave me that one, why not? Let's go talk to Pravati. Who ordered the bottles of Raptodon Musk? One has broken. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> oh, there's Raptodon Musk all over the ship now. That's good. Hey, Captain. Can I get your temperature on something real quick? You want to take my temperature? What? 
you're a little creepy. Um, <laughs> okay. Yeah, sure. So, June Lei and I have been talking some. Through messages? I got him here on my data pad, and well, she sent me a poem. One she wrote her own self, I'm pretty sure. I don't nice. know if I should read into it. Because poems are all symbolic and such, right? It's not so good. Uh, how bad can sweet. it be? She rhymed compression alternator with aches to meet her. It's about this engine that's been shaking itself apart. Then this lady mechanic comes by and lays one hand on it. And the trouble goes away. It sings. I don't want to get too hopeful, but I'm Aww. wondering if maybe she's the engine and I'm the lady? It's a real romantic poem. It made my chest hurt, kind of. Well, that's a good thing. Sounds like she likes you. I don't you. know where it's leading yet, or if I'm misinterpreting. I'm not much interested in physical stuff. Never have been. Leastways, not like other folks seem to be. It's not that I can't. I just don't care for it. It's been a problem in the past. The folk who wanted to be with me back in the Vale, they didn't... They said I was cold. Hmm. Well, you're about the warmest person I've ever met. <laughs> to hell with them. Thanks, Captain. That makes me feel a touch better. I actually had another message from June Lei. I just couldn't work up the courage to open it. But okay. I'm going to change that. Right now. Okay. Here we go. Let's see here. Do it. Talking about old friends. Got to thinking. Isabel. Who's. Who's Isabel? Uh, everything okay? We were close, Captain. Like, more than friends close. They were close. Not anymore? I don't know. June Lei talked about them like it was past, but how far in the past? Ten years? Last week? Captain, I'm feeling all mixed up right now. Could we maybe head to the Groundbreaker? Get some drinks at that bar there? The Lost Hope? Yeah, great idea. Drink so everything. <laughs> uh Well yeah, if that's what you want. Oh, thanks, Captain. Let's go. I'll be ready. Alright, Parvati, we haven't left yet, so we can go get a drink. Let's go get a drink with Parvati. Good luck, Captain. Oh, thank you. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna keep who we got. Spricker Max, he seems kinda wise. Maybe uh he can help me talk some uh sense into her, who knows. Maybe I should have taken Ellie. I don't know. Let's go get a drink, guys. No, I wish you kind of would have said something, Parvati, while we were already in here. <laughs> That's okay, though. All right, here's the last hope. And actually, we haven't even been in here yet, so... Kind of cool to check it out. So, how's this work? Do we get a table? Stand in a corner? Hmm. Are we gonna get well. in trouble today? Not that I want to. Just seems to happen around you, is all. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> well, come on in, guys. Come on. There you go. All right. Okay, so 
What are we drinking? You're the expert? Oh, and don't worry on the price. Oh. I got this. Let's just do it proper. Okay, well... <laughs> are you sure you want to do this? You seem nervous. Oh, no, that's just... That's on account of my not being able to sleep lately. Makes my hands all twitchy, you know? I've just been lying awake, okay. thinking about what June Lay said, and I feel my heart shake. Uh. I'd start with beer, but you said in Edgewater the smell made you sick. How about wine? Yeah. Oh, wow. That. You remembered. Well, that's fruit and such, right? Okay, wine it is. Kinda. Bottoms up. Purpleberry wine's all right if you require a sweetness to your spirits. It seems like a drink that would suit you, Miss Holcomb. Just mind how much you imbibe. Wow, this point. is really kind of nice, actually. Who'd have guessed old fruit could taste so good? Oh, Captain. Yeah, just I'm hold on. Doing <laughs> what am I doing? Uh, right now, <laughs> whining it sounds like now. <laughs> Enjoying a drink with your friends. Uh, yeah, I guess we are that, huh? Friends. Friends give each other counsel, right? What do you think well, yeah. I should do about Jun Lei? Because I feel about as aimless as an automech with a busted nav chip. I give counsel to plenty of folks I don't consider to be friends. If you need an ear, Miss Holcomb, I'm listening. Hmm. I'll start by telling me why her message got you so unsettled. Well, she talked about another girl, right? Isabel. Mentioned her by name and everything, like she wanted me to know. Maybe I've been making a right fool of myself this whole time. Maybe she's not interested after all. Well, you're reading way too much into it, I'm thinking. Um... Uh, no one sends terribly vague <laughs> sensual poetry to somebody they don't uh, like. I, I, I don't know. I'd call it uh, sensual. That's a lot. <laughs> the poem implied you calming her with a touch. That's romance serial grade stuff. It did. Oh dear, I hadn't really... Oh my goodness. And I told you... As an <laughs> avid reader and collector of rare tomes, I believe I ought to have a look at this specimen of literary self-expression. What did she actually write in the message? You haven't it said. It was real long and rambly. She was telling me a story about her dad, how a lady named Isabel did all sorts of things to try to win his favor. This Isabel lady never quite managed to get her dad's approval, but they carried on anyways. Made something good out of a bad situation. Then it all went down the tubes. Do you think June Lay still has feelings for her? Uh, <laughs> wow. Well, I don't have perception high enough, I don't think. Yeah, that's locked. Uh, no, I don't think well, maybe, so. Maybe she just wanted to let me know her preferences in a less awkward way. But that made it more awkward. I, I need another drink. Right now. Before I lose my nerve. Uh. Okay, um, let's get you some water, huh? Come on, Captain. I'm here to drink. Okay, maybe you're right. <laughs> Hydration, here I come. Good call. It's best to proceed with a light hand the first time. Shush you. Oh, Captain, <laughs> I want to talk to Junlei all the time. Even about silly things, but I'm so scared. What, what? Um, everything? I got a solar system's worth of terrifying questions swirling around my head. Does she think I'm as pretty as I think she's handsome? What if she doesn't like me? What if she does? What if she's still got feelings for that lady, Isabel? What if we, we get together and she gets bored of me? <laughs> Fuck if I know. I'm just here for the booze. <laughs> uh... Well, 
There's an easy way to get all the answers to all those questions. Oh, there's nothing easy about... about spilling your guts to the person who's got your heart in their hands. You know I'm not interested in physical affection. That's... Well, it's tripped folks up in the past. Folks I thought cared about me for me. What if she's not okay with that? What if she is, but then later, she's not? So, you're afraid of disappointing her? Or are you afraid of being rejected for who you are? Um, I don't know. Of course. We'll go with this one. Wouldn't you be? Everyone is, no matter oh. their quirks. I never thought of it that way. I wonder what June's afraid of being rejected for. She seems perfect to me. Yeah. Maybe those are just my rosish colored goggles talking. To be strong like her. Gosh, I don't know that I got that in me. Sometimes I feel real mean inside, Captain. I think ungenerous thoughts. Well, something to work on then. Yeah. I like the way you put that, like... It's okay to want to be better for her, and not impossible to try. Well, Captain, this has been... This has been a whole lot. I got just... Wow. So much to think about. So... Are you gonna ask her out? Oh, gosh. I... I don't know, Captain. Do you think I should? Uh, I could do Persuade, or Determine... I haven't gotten a Determination yet. So I think I'm going to do this one. Uh, don't ask for my opinion. Believe in yourself. Okay. I, I'm going to do it. I'm going to ask June out. Just as soon as we get back to the ship. I mean, probably. Eventually. Thanks for hearing me out and giving me counsel. <laughs> and, well, for being a friend. It means a whole lot. You're good people. You're Captain. welcome. Well, it's not like I could be elsewhere. Nor am I capable of neglecting a wayward lamb in need of guidance. Huh. All right. Thank you, guys. You're real good friends, you know that? I wish... I wish there was a place we could all live quiet together. Come on, let's go. Oh, we can't do. On a ship. Okay, guys, let's go back to the groundbreaker. It's kind of an interesting little side thing. I think all the companions on here, uh, they all have a little side quest. Uh, we did part of hers. We also did part of Vicar and Magnus. The other two, we haven't kind of haven't gotten nothing about them yet, but I'm sure we probably will. for sore ocular processors, Captain. Or rather, your headgear is. Oh, thanks. Um, did you just insult me or compliment me? <laughs> I really don't know. Uh... Okay, I took her body back to the ship. Why did it not... Okay, maybe I gotta I talk to her again, yeah. ...of having Sam clear up some floor space. We didn't really need that crate of toilet paper, did we? <laughs> really? You threw out the toilet paper? What the heck, Ada? Yeah, we kind of need that. Hey, Captain. I hope I wasn't too much bother at the bar. I did have fun, and I tried some things I never would have otherwise. Some of the drinks we tried I even liked. I guess it's not all disgusting. And I don't feel it today. I guess that water must have worked. I'm glad I had you looking out for me. 
Well, I'm glad to hear it. Um, but, more importantly, did you talk to June I Lee? I messaged June Lei when we got back and she replied super quick. <clears throat> okay. I was awake half the night thinking about what I sent, anxious to see what you said. I reread my message in the morning and it was unclear. I was drinking when I sent it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have had the courage. Also, sorry for the typos. Hmm. Okay, not bad so far. I've ruined things in the past because I didn't say things I should have, like, I've met someone who's become special to me. I want to be honest with her, so if she feels the same about me, there won't be any surprises. Uh huh. So, Jun Lei does like you, and she said it in the most awkward way possible. Oh, isn't she sweet? Like one of those two-bit romances where one soul's all stiff and formal, and I should be glad to perhaps take hold of your hand, miss. I ought to go write her back. I mean, I already did. Twice. But anyhow, <laughs> thanks for taking me out, Captain. You're welcome. Well, she was awful giddy there. So, yeah. Okay. Now we can move on from that for now. Let me see here. Travel to Relay. We might do that, but first let's... Uh, Welcome back, Captain. Have a word later. Now that you have acquired a nav key to Stellar Bay, would you like me to contact Dr. Wells? Yeah, put him on screen. Well done. You'll love Monarch. Exotic climate, violent native species, fascinating culture, really. You'll need to speak with Hiram Blythe. He's known as the information broker, and for good reason. If anyone knows where I can find those chemicals, it's Hiram. I need those chemicals to revive the Hope's colonists. They can help us fight back against the board. They can help us set things right. If we don't put a stop to the board, they're going to drive this colony toward a complete societal collapse. You'll see what I mean when you arrive on Monarch. Okay. You'll want to hire the services of a skilled guide. I recommend a hunter by the name of Nioka. Frequents the drinking establishments of Stellar Bay. Very hard to miss. Once you have everything you need, Make your way to Hiram Blythe's compound. Best of luck. Okay. Everyone on the Hope is counting on you. All right, level up again. Um, I'm gonna bring this up to forty. <laughs> and. Bring this up a little bit. Hmm. See, if I get him to 50, I can actually... But for now... Give myself some more defense. Just to get that up there. And my leadership a little bit. We'll put three in each. And we have a perk. Plus 25% movement speed during TTD. Uh, tactical time dilation, which I kind of think I did want. Because I rely on that quite a bit. Uh, bonus dialogue skills when you have no companions in the party. I don't want that. I usually have companions, so. Precision, companion crit chance. Uh, 
Uh, scanner, what's this? 20% bonus to extra headshot and weak spot damage. I already got that. Okay. Well, we're going to go with Speed Demon. Uses time dilation. And I don't think anybody else... Oh, Sam can level up here. What's up, Sam? He gives me a bonus to Intimidate. We're going to take that. Oh, got another one from him. Twenty percent negative reputation per kill. Okay, that means if I kill somebody in a uh, in a faction, then okay, we're gonna go not to Monarch, but I think we're gonna go here first. Uh, we have a mission for that one. Okay, we're gonna take Sam with us. Ah, uh, who else do I want? I don't think I really need anything for any special skills. So let's take Felix. See how they do. All right, guys, you ready? Estimated cleaning time. 59.11 minutes. Wonder if it's empty. Okay. Oh, hello. Oh, that's barred. Okay. Going to go this way. Oh crap. Alright, uh um, Muting volume now. We're gonna skip over that. Oh the one you guys just set that off? Oh wait. Can Sam not get through there? <laughs> Sam. You're killing me. What do we got here? Tactical shotgun. Crap. On the job. Oh, <laughs> that is like really dumb move. Oh, Sam's got a nice one, though. Oh, good job, guys. All right. Good job. Huh. Did you walk through there, Sam, and you didn't get hurt? Pretty interesting. Somebody's journal. Armor parts. <laughs> Anything around here? Oh man, I can like do a lot of sneaking. That'll lead me to another part of the ship. Oh, oh, oh. Resistance cleaning efforts. Huh. 
that. Nice. I like Sam's move. Everyone all right? Yeah. Oh, Sam's pretty badass. I like that. Good job, Sam. Another uh, one of this guy's journals. A necklace. Let's sell that for some good money. Let's get into this. Nice. Good stuff there. So that special hammer that I got, I actually uh, I don't use it much. And the way I play, I'm probably better off with uh, something a little smaller as far as a uh, hand weapon. So when I get the opportunity, I think I'm just going to give that one to uh, somebody that will use a hammer. Like Pravati Special, she uses a hammer. Maybe I'll give it to her. what I'm thinking. Oh, oh, oh. Hello. Hello, janitor. Bathroom. Bathroom with goodies in it. Sam, come on. Thank you. Goody goodies. Oh, hi Sam. <laughs> oh, all this up. Oh, oh. I hit him from here. <laughs> this move is so stupid. Alright, good job, guys. Oh, Sam can fly. Yeah, this is the room we were just above. Body for use. Another journal? Yeah, he's long gone. You think? Oh, there was the guy who uh, wrote the journal. Thought I was picking up the stuff on, on mechanical. Apparently, it was his stuff. Uh, let's see what we got. We got. Oh, it's called Silencer. Special effect bleed. Uh, 82 damage. Damage per second is 214. Melee weapon attack speed plus 15. Huh. So. Oh, no, 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 no. Silly. 
Because I was going to give that one to Parvati anyway. Okay. It is faster than, definitely faster than, uh... Other hammer. The hammer's kind of slow. I'm not real sure. I don't remember what we were looking for in here. Jeweled ring. Another journal. Barred. That's got to be where that other one's barred. Yep, it was this one right here. So, this might be the room we had to be in. Let's see. Use terminal. Activate relay transmitter. Nice. Okay, that's pretty much what we had to do. Uh, return the data to Edna on the groundbreaker. All right. So I don't know if we're gonna go back to the groundbreaker uh, just yet, or whether or not we're gonna go to continue on to our main mission. But that was this. I kind of thought this would be a little longer, but that's okay. It was kind of fun to do anyway. Alright, let's go back to the uh, unreliable. and the vicar are arguing again. <laughs> They're arguing again? All right. Gosh. No, I can't leave you guys uh, alone for a minute. You don't think that's a problem? Whole ship's running on a computer's fancy. Does that not make you nervous, Preacher? No, Felix. The concept of a ship computer does not make me nervous. Are you scared of Ada? I ain't scared of Ada. Good. I'm glad we cleared that up. It's just, she's a computer, Max. What happens when her equations tell her to cut off her oxygen? Or blast us all into space? Felix, Ada is not sentient. She can't act out of a sense of malice. Where do you get these ideas? I was watching true stories of mechanical murderers last night. One of these <laughs> days, I'm going to make you read an actual book. <laughs> uh, I don't know exactly if it was a, an argument to per se, but it was a conversation. Oh, that's funny. That is funny. Okay, well, I'm not sure what we're going to do, whether or not uh, we're going to go back to the Groundbreaker, or we're going to keep going on to Monarch. I mean, cause I, I think we could, we're going to have to go back to the Groundbreaker eventually anyway. So, we might just continue on to Monarch. I'm not sure, but we'll do that next time. So, I'm going to end this weird, end this one here. And uh, I thank you for uh, tuning in. Please like and subscribe. Uh, feel free to follow me on Facebook. I'll leave the link in the description below. And thanks for coming. And I'll see you next time.